In a nice village with lots of trees lives Peppy the panda, happy as can be. As Peppy walks around with a big smile, he thinks of something fun to make us smile. Hey there, little friends. It's your pal Peppy. Today I've been thinking about something really exciting to share with you. Look, friends. It's a telescope, and it's really special. It helps us see far, far away into space. We live on a big, beautiful planet called Earth. And there are many other planets out there just like our Earth. Let's use the telescope to check them out. How awesome is that? Let's get in and explore planets. Come along with me. Let's learn and explore the wonders of space. The countdown begins, and up we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Wow, did you see that? That's our home Earth. It's a big blue planet covered in oceans and land. And look, there goes our friend the moon, waving goodbye as we head off into space. Earth is where we live. And it's full of amazing things like trees, animals, and people just like us. It's like a giant playground for all of us to explore and enjoy. The first one we see is Mercury. It's closest to the sun and super hot, like standing next to a giant campfire. Also, Mercury is the smallest planet in our solar system, but it zooms around the sun super fast. It's like a speedy little racer in space. Then there's Venus, covered in thick clouds and even hotter than Mercury. And guess what? Venus has volcanoes that shoot out hot lava. It's like a giant cooking pot bubbling with fiery lava. Next is Mars, known as the red planet because of its reddish surface. It's pretty cold there, so make sure to bring along your cozy jacket. And did you know that Mars has polar ice caps, just like Earth? It's so cool to think about ice on a planet that looks so red. After Mars, we have Jupiter, the biggest planet of all. It's like a giant ball of colorful stripes and has a big storm called the Great Red Spot. Also, did you know that Jupiter has more than 75 moons? It's like having a whole bunch of friends orbiting around you all the time. Saturn comes next with its famous rings made of ice and rocks. And did you know that Saturn is so light that it would float on water if there was a big enough bathtub? Imagine having a planet-sized bathtub toy. And look at Uranus. It's blue like the ocean, but super icy and windy. Neptune is also blue like the ocean, but it's icy cold and really windy too. It's like sailing through a frosty breeze on a gigantic blue ice cube floating in space. And here we are, back at our beautiful Earth. It's so special because it's our home and it takes care of us by giving us air to breathe, water to drink and food to eat. Let's make sure to take care of our wonderful planet so it stays beautiful for all the adventures yet to come. Thanks for joining me on this incredible adventure through space, my little friends. Let's keep exploring and learning together.